check this place out guys right off the bat you got these really cool crab pot floats are out there these are nice they're the older ones each one was a different color for each person look at all these signs it's a cool little place don't know what it's gonna look like inside that Texaco sign is pretty cool all right let's head on in see what they got how many of you remember this ride how cool it's got some nice old duck um, decoys they're cool see you have all the different numbers these are older ones right here that's pretty cool oh my gosh look at this if you remember riding in one of these comment down below super cool all right let's get permission all right guys here we go well, look at these these are nice decoys oh here we go oh man oh this one's that's a bigger one i've never seen that oh, absolutely okay you hit there i want to see what else we got that great little santa right here boyd's bear santa i don't think i've ever seen that one i have to look it up i'm talking really really fast because i'm a little too close to that radio so we're going to move away from it. There we go. Ooh. That's cool. Wow. That's in Dubai. It's one of the big buildings over there. Let's see what the price is on that. I'm not seeing one. $30 for the... This one right here. Sorry, my fingers, nails are not done because we spent the whole day, our whole time I've been here fishing with my brother and crabbing. So, can't really have nails at that point. <laughs> oh, I love this. The prices are really good. So, look at this, guys. Now this would be an, a later or earlier Fenton, like 1970s and afterwards. This is not marked, it's a beautiful amethyst. These are online for about $25 a piece, um, which is a really good price. I might come back and grab those. But we're gonna look around it's a little bit more. Oh wow, check out these mallets. These are so cool. These are crab mallets. Skipjack seafood, go ahead and turn it over. Is there any others? Oh no, they're not even the older, older ones. Older ones are even better. Yeah. Because the older ones won't have an area code, by the way. Yep, no area code. And I got shells. These are not from here, by the way. But I'm digging the coral. Look at that. It's a pretty piece of coral. Oh, I'm gonna find a bunch of that in Florida. So I wanna try to get down there and go get some fishing. There's a certain friend of mine who we talked about going out for uh, for some fish. Hope she's still on for it <laughs> but by the time I release this it, it, she might already uh, we might have already gone fishing oh wow look at that mug and lure that is so cool how cool is he on Star Wars wow all the light up signs and the prices were like look at this Marvel Avenger Titan Hero series, $18. He's got a few scuffs, but he was played with. So you have to expect that. I haven't played him with it. Oh, look, it's Lamb Chop. It's a little bank. Oh my gosh, that's so cute. $10, she's missing her plug. Boy, she dirty too. <laughs> she had dirty money. <laughs> Oh, oh, there's so much to see here. That's incredible. Wow. All right. Deb, if you're watching, do you see what I see? Right, let's see what the price is on them. Roseville, $65. White rose. More Roseville. This is pretty. The salt. Salt uh, pottery. Row candlestick. This is only twelve dollars. Really? It's nice. I have to think about that one. Let's see what they want for it. Thirty-nine dollars. 
a piece of rose velvet there. That's not bad. Oh, this is gorgeous. Piece of swung. It's a nice carnival glass swung. Or stretched. $24. Hmm. I see a seam. I love stuff like this. Oh, here we go. Can't go anywhere without my see if it's a seam. Jadeite, huh? Oh, thought it would glow, but it doesn't. Hmm. Love the old jugs. <laughs> Bed and breakfast. It's, that's not my camera. It's actually leaning. It's pretty cool. This is, I like these. Oh, they're definitely not Pyrex, but they're cute. All right, guys, this is, this is funny. Oh my gosh. Did you see this? <laughs> what in the world is this? Let's see. It's a pig cookie jar, but how do you get, oh, its head comes off, okay. $32, I love it. Oh my God, it's so cute. That is so cute. We got some more Roseville over here. Oh, I'm liking that. That is so cool, that jug. It's different. I like that. Love this pine cone pitcher. $12. Hmm, I don't know if they still do any good. Why did you see Kitty Puss Puss? There we go. $12. Can't see the bottom. Yes, I'm going to peel back an A. Even inside of an antique store, sorry. I don't like to buy things that don't have a polished bottom. It's made in China, but it's cute. I like the colors in it. I still like the colors. Isn't it pretty? I like the fact it has a little circle. Oh, these are pretty. Nice little fent in here. This one's painted, raised. Nice frosted glass. On this one, twelve dollars. Wow, looks really good. Looks like it's got some gold into it. It's missing some of it here, but not much. The sign goes around. There's a few scratches on it. This one has like the original everything on it. Forty-five. That'd be about right. This is gorgeous. How much they want for it? Forty-eight dollars. Yeah. Beautiful blue dot. Oh, this is neat. Love that. There's so much neat stuff here. Oh, this is nice. Seven dollars for this one. Wish there was another cat train. <laughs> It's a good thing I'm traveling, that's all I got to say. What a great little pumpkin. I like that one. I like the mixture of colors in it. There we go. That's interesting with the flower. It's a lantern. Love all the hobnails are right about price. So that's it's a good price, especially for collectors. There's so much in here. Five dollars. Look at these. These are great. Maple leaf candlesticks. Five dollars. Is that for the pear? Because I will grab the pear if that's what it is. Let's see. Burlington, Canada. Or is that a piece? I think it's going to be a piece, guys. Yep, it's a piece, so... Oh, this is pretty though. Pocket watch shaped ashtray. That's pretty. Right, hold on. Ooh, check out this one. This is so cool. I think she said there was 10%, yeah, 10% off all the stock in the booth. Booth, huh? <laughs> I can't talk today. Oh, we just pulled out earlier to keep going down. Oh, look at the paperweights. Yes, please. Any cute ones? 
Uh, that one's kind of not so cute. This looks pretty. I like it with the birds. I feel like they're going to collide with each other. See them inside? Oh my gosh. Hmm. We had a little mermaid there. Nice little Fenton. A nice Geo Rock. I think I like the Geo Rock the best. <laughs> no, it's some pretty stuff in here. Wow. Huh. Ooh, check out the poodle. Oh, wow. Oh, that's enough. <laughs> wow. Oh, there's the ponto on the back, on the bottom. See it? Oh, this is beautiful. Look at this. Oh, wait a minute. Does that look like a, rep looks like a repair right there, guys? $12. Glass dog. Ooh. Oh, that's so sad. Oh my gosh, what a beautiful puppy. I've seen some of these. They're the older ones, if this is one of them. These guys go for like a hundred and something dollars a piece. That is so sad. Oh my gosh, so sad. So sad. I can't believe she's broke. And repaired. Somebody really loved her. All right, so what else do we have here? We got some great pieces, wooden vase, some old vintage uh, bottle openers. We got a sooner down there, it looks like. Lots of fruit, hand blown fruit. Um, this would have been nice, but it's got a big crack in it, which is kind of sad. Let's see a nice Fenton. This is pretty, especially if you have like the beach thing. What $45 just for that? So it's being sold separately. Hmm. Dang, guys. I'm trying to find something that's like really cool, miraculously cool. <laughs> Probably even some encyclopedia. Might pick that up. <laughs> see, $45. Italian oh, optical vase. That's really cool. It's really pretty. It's really huge. <laughs> it's huge. Got some Pyrex here. These prices are pretty much spot on. Yeah, these are so pretty. I can't remember the, some of the, the designs on them. Oh, these are nice. A little cute. Elephants here. Say so what for those? This looks newer, to be honest. Oh, there's a crack all the way across. Never mind. <laughs> Never mind. Oh wow! Walk away from the boat, Mary. Love that. Orange County Chopper Pez. Oh, that's pretty. Wow, that's very pretty. Let's see what their faces on it. 120. That sounds about right. <laughs> oh, I would love to take that home for my house. That is gorgeous. That master head is. Look at these. Wow, they took. <laughs> Are these made like this? I don't know. Definitely interesting. Okay, I can't find anything. I think somebody made these. They usually have a bottom to them, but it's not the hobnail on it. Oh, these are really nice crystal f pillars. Surprise on those. These are 50. It's about right. I think they sell for about 40, between 40 and 60 online. I still want that master head. I can't see what the price is, but it would have to be like way below the 100 mark for me to buy it. Because they sell for, I think, around 150 on it. So much cool stuff here. Wow, the statue is amazing. What do we have? 15% off. Oh, a glass booth. Ooh. <laughs> Look at the pretties. Oh, I love these. Wow. 
These are amazing. I remember these. Oh, I like the Christmas ornament. That's pretty cool. These are all White House collection. So cool. So, so cool. <laughs> oh, is this Jimmy or Jim Shore? Look at these. $20 a piece on those. Oh, the all Jim Shore. Wow, and it's how much over 15%? Hmm. I have to look those up, guys. It's a nice milk glass. Sugar and creamer set. That's nice. I have 15 on that. It's actually a very good price. I love the old pipes. My dad smoked a pipe. I think that's why I have a thing for them. I don't know why, I just do. Some pipes can actually go for good money. It's according to who the maker is. Complete works of Shakespeare. She's pretty cool back there. Nice piece. I love when they put the art <laughs> back behind the wall. Wow. I see a nice piece of crackle glass in the back back here. Is that a, oh, that's nice actually. Oh, it's um, oh, it's a float ball. Ten dollars. It actually has a major crack in it. It's not part of crackle glass. It's just crack <laughs> glass. Oh, these are neat. Forty-eight dollars for the bunch. That's about right. If you're wondering, I'm looking for like the ultimate piece to pick up. I want to find something that's just pretty rare to find, hard to find, something unique. He's kind of cool. I like his fish. He's not new or unique. He's new, but he's not unique. Um, that is gorgeous. Wow. Okay, hold on, guys. That is just so beautiful. So they're right at price on it. Not much room for me to move on any of this right here. Which is fine. I mean, great prices. If you're a collector, it's dead on from what I'm looking at. Oh, check him out. <laughs> oh, he is so cool. Antique iron clock. Double head candlestick. Not usually into this type of stuff. It's a shame there wasn't the second one. What's the price on it? 55. That's just about right. I want to say. That's about right. Oh, that's pretty. Look at that color. 55. Now yeah, that'd be about right on that Hobbs. It's a Hobbs Brocknovich. It's a Hobnail. It's pretty. It's beautiful. Set of ten. Oh no. A color green. It's gotta be the right color. Nope. Still looking for the rest of my bowls for my collection in my kitchen. Let's see what else we can find. Oh, nice. That is so cool. <laughs> I like neat stuff. Things are unique. You see so much that's flooding the online. I just want to find something different. Hmm. Sorry, I was trying not to do that hmm sound. <laughs> I got told I do it too much, so I'm trying to catch myself doing it. <coughs> love the shards. I absolutely love these shards. Mind you, somebody who goes out to do the uh, digging for bottles. It's pretty. I love that with the face on it. See it, guys? Let me see this real quick. Oh, it's good and heavy. Any signatures on it? It's really well polished. I don't see a price, though. There's no price, guys. And in an antique store, 
that's never a good thing. Let's see what else we can find. Right, go here and catch up. I'm out with family, so I'm trying to stay caught up here. Ooh, jewelry. Oh, no, how cool is that? Not sure if I like the carving. I think I like this more. <laughs> oh, those are cool. 125 piece. It's a little bit high, I think. Could be wrong. Each one of these are different vendors, which is seriously cool. Wow, that is so neat. Look at that. It's a sail vase. Is it signed? It is. It is signed. Wow. That is really pretty. So sorry about my hands again, guys. Unfortunately, I can't grow nails because of my disease from my cancer. So just they just break off. But that is really neat. I might have to look into that because that is a unique, cool piece. I like it. Is there anything broken? No. Let me check it out, guys. Oh, sorry. Sorry about that. There. Better picture it without my finger in it. Let's try that again. Yeah, just look this up. This is like right at retail. So cool though. Really is. All right, let's go check out some more stuff. Oh my gosh, hold on. Jim, Jim, look. Just your flamingos. My brother loves flamingos. Look at that thing. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Love it. This is gonna be the coolest one so far. Love the duck decoys. Hello. That's okay. Look at Grizzly. They're so cool. All right. Oh. Wow. Did you see this in the glass? No, Beautiful great. hand carved. Yeah, that is super cool. Yeah, love that. Goose tray. <laughs> I like that with the tobacco and you can put your pipe and stuff in there. Well, seriously neat pieces. This is a nice piece right here. Love the decanter. Some of those can go for really good money, but they've got theirs priced at 65 and There's no percentage off on this one, guys. Sorry. So many cool items I want to grab. <laughs> so many. So many cool things. Look at this. The mask is the bomb. Wow. Some beautiful pieces. I mean, they're dead on for price, too. Some of them got a little bit of room, but not a lot. Oh, I really wish they had percentage off in here. $95 for the whole net eggnog set. And a lot of the Pyrex is, like, spot on for retail. Or collector. Got some Longa Burger. Happy Mother's Day. Some really neat pieces in this. I like things that are unique. I haven't got to buy anything yet. I'm just not seeing anything that's like really catching my eye. I'm sure it's like a million stuff you guys catching your guys' eyes, but not, not mine. But what do we have here? Gold colored bracelet. Almost looks like a. a, a oh, almost like an Avon piece. Here's a nice butte. $195 dead on. Songbird. This is all carved. Look at the detail on this bird. It's worth every bit of $125, if not more, probably. Oh, wait a minute, guys. Let's see if we can. Can we make the barnacles glow? Any of them? Let's see. Any uranium ones? Let me know if you see. Oh, there's a glower. Love this. of the willows oh my gosh how cute is this oh my goodness I have a set of these bunnies but these are that's awesome the fishing ones wow that is so pretty <laughs> love that fishbowl don't have to feed them 
15 inch piece. Let's see. Denmark it is $24. It's a piggy bank. Huh. I like that. I have to look at this guy, sorry. I had a sticker on the bottom. That's pontled. Fish paperweight, $18. The fish are kind of, I mean, they're cool, but they're a little bit, you know, want something that's really cool. So I love the pondle fin, um, bunnies. These are so neat. Come on, I gotta go out of here with one thing. <laughs> Just one. It's not what I thought it was. I thought it was one of the hand carved pieces. I love the whale. It's an ashtray, too. The old ashtrays. I'm actually going to walk out of an antique store with absolutely nothing in my hands. I don't think this has ever happened to me, ever. I don't know if it's because I'm traveling and I just want to find like the ultimate piece. Now this swan here, I love this. I'm tempted to get it because the sales on this I know go for about $125 if not up higher. I have a really big one at home. I'll put that one on instead. Some old music. Great. Oh, oh my gosh. I'll take the 427 any day of the week. Look at that. Can we, um, can we bag that and put that in? <laughs> take that with us. Okay, so the only item I found this whole thing that I wanted was the poodle. And I didn't get it. I didn't get to have it. It's the Chesapeake Bay Bridge. I, uh, oh wow, that's Jim Spillane. What if that's Mike Spillane's brother? I say I grew up here on the islands in Maryland, so I'm just curious about that. He took the picture. Um, this would be on the eastern shore in Kent Island. It's very cool, very pretty. This is beautiful too. I love the colors. Love the black set upon that green. It's really pretty. Nice charcoals. All right, guys. So. Really great place having a Route 13 on your way to the Chesapeake Bay Tunnel. We're going to go on and head on out of here. Unless I come up with something really cool.